The painting comes from the collection of Fulvio Orsini and entered in the Farnese collection in Parma as a work of Parmigianino, before arriving in Naples in the 18th century. It was Roberto Longhi who returned it to the hand of Rosso Fiorentino in 1940. Despite the unfinished state, this painting is considered a masterpiece of the 16th century portraiter. The young man sits on a table covered with a carpet with an oriental flavor in what seems to be a bedroom. On the left you can see a green curtain and a ionic capital with an erma, while on the right you can see a Madonna and child with a gold background and a pomegranate. The identity of the young proud man is not yet clear, but certainly he appeared to a very rich aristocratic family. In fact, he is wearing a black dress among the most expensive of the time. And also the very beautiful Caucasian carpet refers to the wealthy of his family. The boy's clothing and his face are extremely defined, while the objects in the room are barely sketched. The unfinished state of the painting and the mysterious of the young man make the painting one of the peaks of the Toscan Manuris, who sees Rosso Fiorentino as a great experimenter. Portrait of a sitting young man, Rosso Fiorentino, 1525-1527.